Hi, my name is Ashok Kamath and I am with a non-profit based out of Bangalore in India called Akshara Foundation. Many of you will feel ashamed if you did not know how to read something and would be you know, ashamed to admit that you were not literate. But the same does not hold true for numeracy. Uh, I've met many smart people in various conferences, conference rooms around the world where when they say numeracy, people say, oh, I didn't you know, really like math when I was in school. So, you know, they're not ashamed of the fact that they don't know foundational numeracy. We started to think, uh, you know, in a different manner in the 21st century, you need foundational numeracy more than ever. And we said, we need to change this perception. One of the big reasons why, you know, uh, people are scared of math has always been the fact that math was taught as an abstract subject, whereas math need to be taught, moving from the concrete to the abstract. And this is what we've done for several years now uh, in approximately 70,000 government schools uh, in India. Children have access to an innovative kit that they use and understand concepts in early numeracy. Along the way, we also made investments in putting all that in digital form. And this was anticipating the need as the world goes uh, more and more digital. We kind of anticipated this uh, more than three years ago. And with support from the Cisco Foundation, we created a, an innovative app that was, that was and is free to anyone called Building Blocks. Building Blocks was designed to work at on entry level Android smartphones. Uh, in, in India, about 91% of all smartphones use Android, and that seemed to be the uh, correct target market for us. So the, the app works on an Android smartphone, and because of the multitude of languages in India, we decided to launch it in nine languages, including English. So other parts of the world that speak English can actually leverage of what we've done. Also, we said that the product has to work both offline and online. Offline because there are many parts of rural communities where you don't have access to good network connectivity. Finally, it has to be simple enough uh, to be able to work with little children, grades one through five, who enjoy it and for them it should be intuitive and fun and at the same time they learn concepts in math. Building blanks and the taxna namu kushi agoitu games ardangu atittu matte lekugulu kalkondangu atittu. So building blocks ended up as a, a suite of over 260 different games that was mapped to India's national curriculum framework. Uh, in terms of grade and competencies and themes. We have these games both in a practice mode and then a challenge mode. So we want to allow the child to practice for a while and then also ask the child to be challenged and if the child succeeds, moves on to the next level. So this is the progression that we've designed uh, and uh, children love it. Uh, many educators have told us that this is probably the most, you know, educative in the sense of it teaches children concepts rather than just, you know, testing their skills. So this product now is available on Google Play Store and you can download it by going to the Play Store and looking for building blocks by Akshara. Once you download it, you can start to install it. It will ask you for your identification and also uh, ask you for your language. Uh, we, like I said, we have nine languages, including English. And then it assigns an avatar to you. The same phone can be used to anchor up to six children using six different avatars. And every time this phone, uh, children play on this, uh, in the back end, we record what's happening, how children are playing, how much time they spend on the game, so that 
when they sync with our servers, we get all this data and start to see insights as to what works better and what does not. So we've been doing this through the Google Play Store with more than, I would think, uh, 350 to 400,000 avatars in play right now. But the larger opportunity for us was working with India's education ministry, who have a portal called Deeksha. All textbooks today uh, in India have QR codes at the end of the chapter, which when you scan, takes you to the Diksha portal where the building blocks games are unbundled and made relevant to the chapter under consideration. Uh, at this point, we have approximately 33 million textbooks across four states in India that are QR coded leading to the building blocks application. We are seeing children in the millions, you know, playing these games uh, on a regular basis. Of course, the unfortunate pandemic has created new opportunities because it allowed us to think of ways and means of penetrating and something like building blocks was the perfect answer. So in a sense, we were ready for the digital world uh, long ago with our investments in the digital space. And this is now you know, giving us uh, a lot of benefit uh, to us, of course, to improve product, but also to a lot of children to learn math effectively.